recently released on Blu-ray by Arrow Video is the 2019 uh, horror drama, The Deeper You Dig. This was an indie film that I had not actually heard of until the Arrow Video release uh, arrived on my doorstep. And it uh, is a d story about a, a mother and daughter who are, she's sort of a scam psychic and they, they pull psychic scams on people. And uh, this nearby neighbor who's renovating a house. And uh, not to give too much away, if you don't want to know anything that happens in the movie, just skim forward a little bit. But um, one night this man is coming home, I think it may have been during a snowstorm, and he accidentally winds up hitting the daughter with his car, and he panics, and he buries the body and acts like nothing ever happened. And apparently the spirit of this girl would like somebody to know that something happened. So she basically starts haunting this guy in this cold, you know, half completed uh, or half renovated house while the next door neighbor mother and this man who's his da her daughter's murderer are getting more friendly as neighbors. And uh, it's this complex dynamic of, you know, having this secret you want to literally keep buried while the secret itself doesn't want to remain under the surface for very long. So what you have is the story of this, this you know, guy who's very alone uh, and spends his time fixing up this house and keeps seeing things. Things that are at first sort of obtuse and obscure and over time become clearer and clearer that it's the spirit of this girl that he accidentally killed. And, you know, is, is it in his mind? Is it really happening? Um, it, when the mother starts getting involved, is she, does she really have powers? Can she really communicate with the beyond? If she can, you'd think she'd be able to communicate with her dead daughter. And um, it just gets more and more uh, intense and, and, and brutal as this, uh, this tale unfolds. And, you know, is the man going to admit to what he did? Is the mother going to discover what he did? Or is the ghost of this little girl going to just let everybody know and possibly take the guy out for doing what he did? So, um, again, a film I'd never heard of. This is apparently a f one of several films or features that was done by a group called The Addams Family, not That Addams Family, uh, who, who worked together to make films. Um, I, I kind of was okay with it. I didn't love it. I, I was intrigued because, again, I went in blind not knowing what was going to happen in the film. Um, some of the effects were very well done. Some of the, uh, I'm, I'm a fan of, of, you know, the instance and the technique in film where you're not quite sure if what's happening is real or imagined or some kind of a plot to make somebody go crazy. And that's what kind of goes on in this film. Um, some of the effects were just a little bit too, um, a little bit too computer generated for me uh, and took me out of the film a little bit. Um, it's the nature of the beast now. I'm used to things looking a certain way and occasionally something just doesn't mesh well and it takes me out of the movie. But overall, I thought it was very effectively done. I didn't personally love it. I was kind of okay with it. It, it was just a little too, a little too I'm not sure what for me. But I, it's the kind of thing I could see a festival audience really enjoying. And I think if you're open to indie horror or, and you know, horror is... I wouldn't 100% call this a horror movie. I would call this more of a, just like a really dark drama with supernatural aspects to it. I think if you're open to something with people you've never seen before in it, which is actually, to me, a strength of a lot of indie movies is that you're not bringing anybody's previous roles to this new film as baggage. Um, I think if you're open to something that's indie and a little bit outside the box, um, it might be worth your time. Uh, the film has a good amount of extras because the filmmakers are, you know, they're, they're current and they're willing to participate. And geez, if Arrow says they're going to release your movie, I think I would jump in with both feet and give them my childhood home movies and clip yearbook photos if they wanted it. Uh, so there's a lot of behind the scenes and inside info on the making of this film. And also a lot of, uh, if I'm recalling correctly, a lot of um, previous works from this uh, filmmaking collective that you get to see what else they've done leading up to this film on the set. Two disc set if I'm not mistaken. Um, so out now from Arrow Video from 2019 is The Deeper You Dig.